What's happening with the YouTube? It's your boy D Brown back at it with another video. Welcome back to the channel, man. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. One in the corners, hit that subscribe button and follow your boy on the journey. Um, yeah, man. Shout out to everybody that subscribed to the channel. I finally hit 100 subscribers. Um, it wasn't super quick, but it was quick to me. It seemed like it was cute to me. Um, so for that, I want to do a 500 subscriber giveaway. I plan on doing a 500 subscriber giveaway. Um, I want to do, I'm not sure what it's going to be yet, but it might be a PSN code, Xbox One code, it might be a dad hat, something of that sort. Um, not quite sure, but I'll figure it out by the time I reach 500. So yeah, depending on how quick we move, I might do a 250 subscriber giveaway. I might. Not for sure. But yeah, we might make that happen. Um, so yeah, hit that subscribe button so you can have a chance to win that. Um, yeah, man. Uh, so without further ado, we're going to hop into this video. Um, I know y'all see that title. I know a lot of people have been waiting for this video. This is one of the most suggested videos I've gotten or suggested songs that I have gotten. Um, so yeah, we fin I finally brought it. You guys asked for it. And I brought it. So yeah, we're gonna get into this video. Russell Westbrook on a farm. I wonder how he came up with that name. I know the bar is gonna be crazy, so I'm gonna try to pay attention without speaking so much. This beat is so crazy to me. I gotta say something. This dude's flow is dope. I like his flow. Like he, it is dope to me, man. It's, dude can spit. He can definitely spit. I'll give him that. To where I know it's not illusion, but obviously I've been finding this confusing. This ain't even close to what I thought I would be doing. Don't get me wrong, I was born to be big, but I always figured it would be the comedy thing. So I started rapping just to see what drama it brings. But big dogs from sitcoms would holler at me. And that, and that line makes sense to me. That line makes sense to me because he says, he says he thought he would be doing the comedy thing. And you can tell that he like, he puts a lot of humor into his music. And that's what I like about it. Like he makes a lot of humorous jokes in his music and it makes sense that he says that he think he would be doing, he thought he would be doing like comedy, which is dope. I like how he put that stuff together. Time passed, I rhymed fast, the lines crafted was high class as I master my crafting. Goddamn, who'd have thought it'd get like this? Back in 2010, music wouldn't make that list. I'm talking top five to ten strings with no wings. I would not lie, my pen dry with no ink or that's at least what I thought till I clawed and scratched a pen till I saw a line draw. Then I could have let bygones be bygones, but I really wanted to rhyme till my line drawn. <laughs> like where the fuck is my peak at? Not brown, but I make it pop, then I beat that. Not crown yet, but I don't think I decreed that. Not loud, but you know I'm ready to tweet that. I just really hope I'm ready to be that. Now you see him where D's at. Cause even though I'm softer than the tissue, I ain't nothing to sneeze at. I'm smarter, where the fuck your degrees at? And I ain't harder, but I'm hotter, homie. Where the fuck your degrees at? I'm about to <laughs> Bro, he going dumb. And desaturate the sheet wrap today and evaporate the feedback I hate, I elaborate at a later date. But I'm getting off the point with the player hate. What the fuck was I saying? Ah, oh, 
Yeah, I'm kind of a slave to my ambition. I ain't quitting till my shit is appraised. And I admit it, I predicted where I finish is crazy. But that just means that it's further away. So, bird about to work until he turn in his grave. It's really burdensome when earning something fun for the day. But I'm concerned about the burning out from up in the States. I'm always up in the States. I'm taking dinner meetings in New York, always up for the States. We exploring the discussion to great. They assure me that when I'm more elite, I'll be secure and amazed. But this isn't insecurity, man. Like, this the opposite of that. Confidence effect. My biggest problem is I can't honestly relax. Because inside of me, a damn odyssey and acts. And I made a promise that I can't be the body to stop. And I think I need a lobotomy. Little dicky to prophecy. Little bit of anomaly. Not a commodity. Not a facade or a lot of the comedy. She's commonly brought up with dicky. <laughs> oh my god, I ain't even ca- Just- I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't catch everything he said. But that flow is dope, man. His flow is crazy. I'm rewinding this one in. Man, like, this the opposite of that confidence effect. My biggest problem is I can't honestly relax. Because inside of me, a damn modesty and X. And I made a promise that I can't be the body to stop. And I think I need a lobotomy. Little dicky to prophecy. Little bit of anomaly. Not a commodity. Not a facade or a lot of the comedy. Prodigies commonly brought up with dicky. Feeling weird, let me think of an analogy Just imagine for a second What if Russell Westbrook never knew his own mentality Grew up on a farm where the biggest commonality Was people that conformed to the royalist localities To Russell though, it was nothing but normality And he really nice up on the plow in actuality Everybody liked the kid and dug his personality And so the mutuality was somewhat rationality So that you may have made a plan of practicality Not even a plan, it was more of a formality Get a little land and attend to his vitality Then raise a little fan until it all became finality the strategy was just to stay in the course and do your chores when you're happy you ain't need to abort never explore nothing unless you roll around on his horse the one day he was up on his horse that's when he went past the porch the path he normally passes forth was fast and short was after more went faster north the master lord a master more and that is crazy he like yeah let me down tim hopped off looking puzzled at the round rim Saw a ball up in the corner on the ground that Russell started dribbling and giggling and astounded. Then he shot a brick and then a brick and then he downed it. And when he hit it, Russell listened to the fucking sound freak. Shouldn't have been the switch, mate. And he was confounded because he knew that he had... Bro, this dude is spitting. Like, this is dope. I don't know how he came up with this, but this is dope. And if you probably don't know, but I'm from Oklahoma City and this... I fuck with Russell Westbrook, so this is dope. I like how he's talking about him. It's crazy, man. And him, but right now it was still for the fun, just a way to kill the time when the farming was done. Then the walking turned to running, and the hopping turned to jumping and dunking. And Russell had to keep coming because the youngin' was fucking disgusting and loving and running it all of a sudden. The public started to come in abundance and fuck with him because he was butter or hungry, hungry, cuz stories up, Lord. Now, normally, oh my god, like that, then the word got around up to ESPN, and they flying Russell down to compete in the gym. Bunch of grown men looking to belittle the kid because to those men, ball was the reason to live and the goats they've been all in since they was kids so this goat on the motherfucker look like a dick and even though russell knows that he doesn't submit he just chose with a grin and then the game started and this motherfucker take charge make it rain hard d up on these bitches making children of men looking better than his predecessors ever could get turn the animosity to respect and then the thunder called him said they heard a lot about the balling told him that they want to get involved and showed him all the shit that you can get up in the league is so appalling oklahoma city in the autumn hella pretty awesome everybody loved him everybody Not really. looking like they're really fucking falling condominium is so legitimate it's sprawling and this motherfucker on the court straight balling Cash yeah. all up in that ass Lulling at the pass like Where the fuck would I be at up on the other path right If I never stumble upon a game and think of that life Shit Who taking care of my farm? Who taking care of my farm? Bro this Who dude spits I really love that farm He goes crazy man Cake, 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 cake now that's a pound cake, according to Jay-Z and Drake. The greatness ain't about cake. Bro, this dude can spit, man. This is crazy. After I was in the Molino. Oh my god. 
He goes crazy, man. I'm pretty sure I missed some bars in here, so put your favorite bar in the comments, cause I know I know I had, couldn't have caught everything. He spit so crazy on this song, man. And I love how he referenced like how he was referencing Russell Westbrook in his game, and like he was talking about how like how he plays, and what if he never realized his mentality, but basically like. The way he played was like normal to him, so he didn't feel like he was no different. Like, and that's facts. Like, man, this song was dope. Um, I'm definitely gonna do some more little Dicky. Um, don't know which one I should do next because uh, I have so many suggested from. Uh, and so far, all of the little Dicky songs that I've um, reacted to are dope. Uh, yeah, man, this dude need to come out with an album because I'm definitely going to be copying it. Uh, bro, that's crazy. Bro, he got me flabbergasted for real. But, um, yeah, man, hit that thumbs up button if you like this video for me. Um, leave me some more suggestions. Let me know what videos and songs with all that good stuff. And hit that subscribe button if you rock with your boy. If you're new to the channel, yeah, I mean.